Joy. Good morning, Absolute Abundance family. What's up, guys? Welcome back to our channel. So, if you watched the last video, Karen and I did the Never Have I Ever challenge, and I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I thought it was pretty funny. She thought it was funny. Everyone thought it was funny. But I've been getting requests to do a Never Have I Ever challenge with Steven. If we could get the last video to 500 likes, we'll go ahead and film that for you. Today's video is going to be our morning routine, at least for the most of it. Uh, what we do on a weekly basis when we first wake up. When he first wakes up. Hi. By the way, check out his shirt. Check out his shirt. Isn't that cute? Um, his auntie got it for him. Yes, his auntie got it for him. Shout out to auntie. And he is just rocking it. He's, he's, he's chilling right now. He's chilling. He's such a cutie. By the way, he turned seven months. So this video is special because, yeah, he turned seven months. We're doing real quick exercises right when you can get up out of bed. It doesn't take that very long. You can do 30 second to 60 second intervals. And it's really just to help out with you and your core, just to jumpstart your day, start getting your metabolism going, give you a bunch of energy for the rest of your day. And it's just really just for your core. And we're doing regular planks, side planks, and we're going to do the crow position in yoga. Planks are good for your core, also with your shoulders as well, arms a little bit, but mainly it's just going to be working out your core, which consists of your abdominal muscles and also your lower back. So you do it like so. Push-up position, plank position. And I tend to hold this for about 60 seconds, 90 if I feel daring, but this is pretty much what a plank looks like. I'll hold this, if you want something short, 30 seconds. Then, it's important to breathe. Then I go into a side plank, like so. These will help your arms and your shoulders and your wrists a lot more, but it's also working your core muscles, specifically more toward on your side since you're favoring one side. And then you can go to the next. And it works the opposite side of your body. Dosa's trying to plank too, you see him? <laughs> Great form, by the way. Now what I like about these exercises is you see I'm in the middle of a hallway, closet, two rooms, whatever, close proximity. I don't even have a full arm length. I got like a arm and a half and I did it right here. So there's no excuse. You can do it right outside your bedroom door, right alongside on the other side of your bed. And you still get it done. And you're, if you're doing 30 to 60 second intervals, I mean, you're working your core and you can feel your core tightening up. You can feel your blood pumping. Make sure you breathe. If you do that every day, that's better than nothing. Yes. Now, lastly, excuse me, the crow position. Now, the crow consists of being in a squat and you're going to spread your palms as wide as you can. This is really going to focus on your balancing and it's really going to be good for your core. But on the same time, it's going to be good for your arms and your wrist strength. Now I'm pretty much just going to put my legs and they're going to be resting on my back arms. And I'm going to slowly move forward. And I'm going to be lifting till I'm off the ground. And these are harder than planes. So, 30 seconds is a long time. 10 to 20 seconds like that is actually pretty good. But if you can shoot for 30, that's even better. <laughs> I just want to say, great job. You're very impressive. Um, do you think you could show me an exercise with the baby? Yes, I can. Yes. Again, you just wake up. Early morning, you turn on the TV like so. Oh look, it's YouTube TV. 
YouTube TV is great, by the way. So, a quick exercise for you if you just want to work those quick arms and upper chest. Hold them up like so. And you just take them from one side to the other. <laughs> and you know he's going to like it. Yeah, he's like a smiling. Entertain too. You can go one, one. Two. Two. Was that fun? <laughs> or you could flip them around this way so you could see your face and do the same. <laughs> and he loves it. And he loves it. Most important part. Quick little exercises to do in the morning. Just doing simple things like watching YouTube TV. <laughs> and voila. You can also do those planks during 30, 60, 90 second intervals of commercial in between shows, so. That's very true. Just gotta get into the habit. This is Peach, and it, I think this is, <laughs> you have to check out his face. This is first time trying it. <laughs> don't like peaches? <laughs> you don't like peaches? Here. Yeah, he likes peaches. He's been, um, let me clarify before everyone goes, oh, seven months, he's not eating. No, it's not that. It's that we started him off with vegetables, and now that he's gotten used to and loves vegetables, he's now trying peaches as his first fruit. And <laughs> you know what? He likes it. You like everything, don't you? All his Gerber food has just been getting devoured. Yeah. Vegetables, fruits, chicken. The only thing we had a negative a negative reaction with was the oatmeal. The oatmeal, yeah. The hot cereal or something like that, yeah. He, he doesn't like oatmeal, apparently. Have you tasted those peaches yourself? No. You should give it a whirl. Well, you know... Someone did request that we do a baby, what is it? The baby food challenge. Um, so if you guys can get this video to a thousand likes, we'll do the baby food challenge. I should be pretty good at it. Well. But you have like Gerber food that is like three different infused flavors, like kale, mango, sweet potato, that is just gonna be very extremely hard to decipher. <laughs> No comment? <laughs> just leave you alone? You just want to eat? See, with this is, he'll eat that whole thing. It's not really all that big, but. He'll definitely eat this he'll entire He'll eat this, thing. and then he'll eat six more ounces, drink six more ounces of formula. Of formula on top of that. Mm-hmm. And no, I do not breastfeed, if you guys are wondering. No breastfeed. No breastfeeding. I couldn't produce enough milk. If you're a mother out there who is sad about not being able to breastfeed, don't be because at the end of the day, as long as you have healthy eating habits for your child in the very early stages of their life, they'll be fine. Nothing to stress off of. So don't feel bad if you don't, don't breastfeed. Don't feel bad. Don't. Magnificent, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's cool. <laughs> I must say though, this chair, it's a boss chair. Soy chorizo, great alternative, very good, highly recommended. That with some eggs and some corn tortillas, you are golden. You really can't taste the difference. It is literally so hot out here in California. I don't know about you guys, but I am dying. It's been like so hot and, oh, what was that? The hell? Is that something at the door? Yeah, okay. mm-hmm. I, I don't think we were expecting anybody. Oh, but we are expecting some. Let's see. Yeah. <gasps> oh my God, what is that? It's a saucer for dose. Oh. 
Oh, he's gonna be so excited. Check this out, absolute abundance family. Look at this. Oh my God, he finally, you know what? This is perfect because we have the walker and we can't really use it because, I don't know, the wheels are weird on it, but this is great. Oh, we're gonna have to wait until he wakes up, but in the meantime, we're gonna finish up breakfast. Aren't you excited? For showing him or the building part? <laughs> making coffee, but I like making mud. <laughs> Shit. Just get a big ass scoop, find a, a decent sized spoon. Look at that spoonful, okay. Put that thing in the hot water. Sometimes it'd be bubbling up. I gotta watch out. So why do you think it bubbles? Cause the water being too hot. But I didn't make it that hot this time. But yeah, that's, that's the dark abyss right there. That'll keep you going. So is this better than Red Bull? Yeah, hell yeah. I'd rather drink coffee than Red Bull. I think it's healthier, for sure. A little bit. I just got a little bit of cream. I don't do no sugar. Look at that, it's still dark. Man, just a little bit more. Cha cha. <laughs> Nestle. Nestle makes the good stuff. Yes. Highly recommend it. Yeah. All right. Ooh, that's strong. And guys, Steven wants me to try this. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not a coffee drinker, I'm a tea drinker. So you know what, give this video a thumbs up right now because I think I am willing to give it a whirl. Good. Give this video a thumbs up right now. Okay, I'm scared to try it. We gotta let it cool off first. Oh. This mud right here, look at that, all foamy. I'm nervous. I'm gonna get the jitters or whatever. I'm on the shakes. Okay, so the moment of truth. I'm gonna try Steven's mud. I'm scared because like I said, I don't drink coffee. So here we go. It's gonna kick you right in the mouth. Then it's gonna go right through you and oh kick you right God. in the cold. Oh my God, I don't drink this. Take another sip. No. Take another one. <sighs> okay, I swear. Ooh, this so disgusting. My love, I don't understand how you can drink this. All day, baby. Just got done putting together the saucer. But now let's hit you with the montage. concludes today's video let us know what your thoughts are comment down below and if you haven't done so already please hit that subscribe button be a part of the absolute abundance family it's as easy as that tuned for a bunch of new stuff coming our way we got a bunch of new projects got a bunch of new additions and we're just trying to get as much as we can for you guys so our content is more abundant for our all entire family Yes, very exciting things we cannot wait to share with you. We're not going to tell you what it is, but please know that we are definitely investing a lot of time into this channel and um, making content that's more enjoyable for our viewers. Stay um, tuned. Stay tuned. Hit you the guys. like button, subscribe, do all that good stuff. Yes. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. 
the bell button and comment down below for a chance to win a post notification shout out. And today's post notification shout out goes to Mac148. Thank you, you already know, we love you. And like we always say, we'll be back with more videos.